Hey, what up guys? Welcome back to Dead Rising 3. So, as I lag out here, there we go, uh, <laughs> we're gonna go get Diego at the museum. So, uh, what am I looking for here? What do I have in my inventory? Um, I don't want that. Uh, I don't want that. I don't want these. Um, I don't want these. I'm just clearing all this crap up because I'm really not gonna use half this shit. Alright, so I got my ultimate shout. And, uh, my Tsar and my Flaming Sword. Let's not <laughs> grab a Roller Hog this time, because they flip way too easy. Let's just grab a Junk Car. Good old Junk Car never lets me down. And, uh, let's make our way over to the museum, where we're going to get three blueprints. And, <laughs> fortunately for us, they're all actually really cool. Save her. There you go. Oh, him. There you go, Steven. Sorry I called you her. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'll be making that mistake in another episode or two. You'll see what I mean then. Uh, I, d I don't recommend running across this bridge because uh, there are these SWAT guys up here and they can be a pain in the ass if you don't have the right weapons. I'm just going to drive right by them. Let the zombies uh, bug them, you know? Oh, why did I go that way? Don't worry, Nora. I'm coming. Oh, okay. Either This thing either like doesn't drift at all or it drifts like fucking crazy. There you go. Yeah, you do. You should probably leave. This place is booked. Alright, so this museum is this giant building right here we couldn't get into before. Yeah, so <laughs> there's a buffed up quote unquote dude. See what I mean about that in an episode or two. Hey, we might even do it this time. Don't worry, Nick. He's in there all right. All right, let's get out. Uh, I'm gonna get out my fish just because we're gonna get a blueprint right here in the door called the Mauler. Holy shit! Grab it, damn it! Fucking a. That's really annoying. Get out of here. Where's my machete? That's what goes on this thing. It's a uh, machete and a cantana and a cantana and a katana, and it makes this really cool weapon. Yeah, no one cares. I'm not taking that on. I will be doing the psychopath, of course. Let's clear these guys out so it makes my next part a little easier. That is cool. Alright, so Diego's freaking out. Here's a blueprint for a very, very good gun, actually. Called the Chuck Axe. Take a harpoon gun and a fire axe. Mix them together and you got what we're going to use to defeat the next boss. If you couldn't find the harpoon gun, because I've come through here and had trouble finding it, just uh, destroy this case right here. It's right there. So we're going to make our way around here to the left. And run into Diego. He's gonna be going fucking crazy. You can even test this uh, Chuck Axe out. It works pretty well. Oh shit! Works pretty well, but uh, I just want to head over to this console right here and inspect display, which has a machete in it. What the fuck? No. Listen, man, I'm begging you. We, we gotta get out of here. We, we do not have time for this. 
Diego's losing his shit. Get out our chuck axe. And just start hitting him with it. He'll eventually fall to the ground like that. We can run over to him and grab him. Run, 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 run. And just start pressing Y. I've tried X. For some reason it didn't work. But uh, you can only beat like two life bars out of him at a time. The rest of them you gotta shoot off. Of course he's gonna pick up the rock. Throw it. Falls to the ground, you can immediately just grab him and spam in the Y button. And like every boss battle, you just rinse and repeat. Nothing special. He'll go nuts in the middle, like most of them. Come on, throw it. Bitch. Oh, what the fuck? Oh! That's my move right there, buddy. Hitting him with the axe. He'll fall down and you can grab him. Shake him. Bop, bop. Kicks you off. Now he's going to freak out. He's gonna grab this thing down here, drop it on you. It's gonna start spinning. Just look out for the shit. Like, if you stand right here by this rock, you'll be fine. There'll just be stuff cycling around you. And then you just wait for him to stop spinning it. Look at this giant rock. Let me see if I can push it. Uh, and white comes back up. Get out of here, zombie. This thing, yeah. <laughs> Needless to say, this gun works exceptionally on zombies. He's gonna fall down. Shake him. Bop, bop. Ow. This thing has a lot of ammo, by the way, if you haven't noticed. Oh, got me with that. That's the first time I've been hit by that. Now, fall down. There you go. And it ends here. Bunk. Bunk. your mama. About your mama? My mother used to say that to me. About the only thing I can remember when I was a little kid. I feel like I've heard that before. Nick, I gotta show you something. Come here. Come on. I saw something in here that really scared me, man. Like, really scared the crap out of me. Come on. That guy looks familiar. Carlito Keys? Yeah. Well, he was the terrorist that caused the outbreak in Willamette back in 2006. His sister Isabella helped him. They brought the parasite from Central America. Whatever happened, huh? Huh? He died there, I guess. It, it says she disappeared right after that. Man, they were supposed to have the shit under control at the Fortune City, man. I thought those Zombrix chips were supposed to keep everybody in line. Now look at this. Huh? You see this? This really scares the crap out of me, man. This zombie is reported to have begun the Smithville outbreak in 2007, the first outbreak to occur after Willamette. Now look at his neck. No, 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 holy crap, man! No, what is that? 
does that mean, man? I don't know, right? What the hell? Oh, shit. Okay, look, we, we, we need to focus on the problems that we can solve first, okay? Let's get the hell out of town, and then we'll figure out what's going on. You still have that key, right? Shit! Those gang dudes bugged me on the way here. I was so out of it. They took the plane key. Nick, we gotta get it back. <sighs> What is it, bro? Nothing, man. Nothing. It's all good. Let's just go find those keys now. Okay. So, just grab this Frank statue. And I think we're going to take on the psychopath as well while we're here because it's really close and really short. Uh, where am I going? This way. And we're going to grab the, <laughs> the fucking chest beam they said they were going to the mansions man well the rich people live this mask is pretty cool ZDC update this is the chest beam you need a microwave and a motorcycle engine pretty awesome The fuck? I don't want to be in your unit. I'm in my own unit. Alright. Alright, let's uh yeah, let's just run on over there really quickly. Diego, you want yourself, I get it. I really do. Alright, so let's see if we can jump this on our first try. Oh, that was close. Yeah. So we can stay here and help this guy. I'll do it. Fuck it. Where's my chest beam? <laughs> I love this thing. It's really cool. Oh, no special finisher for it though, huh? Wow, okay, it's really not as strong as I thought it was. Get in! Alright. <laughs> I think I just ran over the survivor. Anyway, so, I don't think you can drive through here. We can get back out that way, but that's alright. Anyway. Uh, pretty much any weapon really works for this. I'm going to use the ultimate shout, just because, you know, why not? Yeah, they're all dead. And I take it back. We're not fighting the psychopath this time. Oh, I'm on fire. <laughs> We're going to get the key because it's really short and really easy. Oh, hey, guys. Yeah. These guys are pretty easy. The Chuck Axe works pretty good against them. Or the chest beam, I think. <laughs> cool. They're just up here in the tennis court. Hey guys! And there it is. Alright. That's that. And in the next part, we're going to take on the Psychopath. Once again, really easy fight. Uh, really nothing to it, just like most of the Bass Bottles. Bass Bottles. Boss Battles. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. And uh, join me next time where we <laughs> take on yet another glorious fight. Yeah. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time.